Uh, we're out here at the Cedar Rapids Library to uh, launch our weather balloon. Make John, make sure you do not touch the balloon, okay? Yeah. It comes near. We learn a lot about just honestly teamwork, how to apply the knowledge we've learned over this year to a project and make it the best we can. Sensors inside our weather balloon, uh, that's what this is, to check uh, air pressure and um, like temperature up in the stratosphere. Uh, we're going to what most people call near space. You know, it's interesting is how hard it is to hold a 10 pound balloon down. Yeah. We gotta remember though, this is not gonna equate to the balloon getting bigger. No, it's not. It's just gonna fill with more air. The data that we're collecting is gonna give us uh, barometric pressure that'll help us calculate altitude. Altitude was our big challenge on our first one. We, we knew we were really high, really high, but we weren't sure how high. So now we're gonna actually be able to calculate that. We also are gonna be able to track it on the timeline with when we start to go up, if our cameras start to fail and whatnot, our temperature sensors will tell us what the temperature is. Should turn them on. Is that one on? No. Nope. This purple's got to come off. Here, you hold that. Your cameras are on. You're rocking. Yeah, we're go. Good to go. We're good for lunch. You're gonna need this then. You can let go. It's okay. We can let go. Yeah, we've met. Cause it's tether right here. Yes, yes, yes. All right. <laughs> All right, walk it out. Jacob, and we're just gonna let it. Go. It's gonna go that way. So you're just gonna take it to the corner, and we'll let uh, it go. All right, and don't swing the cameras in it. It's yeah, pulling so up, right? You just let it go straight out. Ready? Woo! There it goes. There we go. <laughs> and it's up. It's going up. <laughs> oh, you're good. Everybody All right. Everybody wave at the camera. Yeah. All right, it's in the air. Follow it. It's going straight up. It's up there. Dyersville, huh? Dyersville. Okay. Okay. Or wherever the wind takes us. Our goal is, is that this balloon is almost twice as big as the other one. We want it to go up quicker and come back down faster so the equipment doesn't fail. The combination of the two, hopefully we'll get our data back today. It'll be exciting. I've only been here for half a year. I'm not one of the original people who came up with the idea for this. Uh, that's what's amazing about Metro Steam Academy is, you know, people start a project and, you know, maybe they graduate and, you know, people gladly take on the project to continue it. And this is where this weather balloons end up from beginning of the year. You hit the jet stream and you know you're higher than commercial airline travel and you're going faster than most things can travel. So it's really cool just to see that and actually have physical data to, to record uh, and, and to correlate with what we've actually done. to Monticello. Uh, it's gonna go east of us and make a loop around. And then we're supposed to drift down there. It's still going up. I don't think it's popped yet. If we, if we get to where we think we're going, we'll be in Dyersville. north instead of northeast yeah. and we hit 38 and then travel up north 
towards uh, Hopkinton. Let's, uh, let's go north. So the road eventually is going to split my, let's say, go to Hopkinton. Yeah. You don't want to turn that way. Okay, so here's what happened. Yeah. At a data point. Yeah. It was 22 minutes ago. Yeah. And we have an identical data point on the same place that says stop. There's like a driveway here. Oh, okay. so this no, it's behind the trees. Oh, okay, good. That makes sense. That's what I'm saying. If you. Is this a homestead though, or is it yes, just a Yes, it's, it's a driveway area? right here. I see it. There's a house. There's up here. a house up here. There's a nice very house. old house. Look at us like we're. Well, they're going to look at us like we're crazy, but we need to go knock on the door. Okay, so we need to have a plan because I huh? believe it's on this field on the right, according to the data. Yeah. And there's an electric fence. But what, do you actually see something, yeah. though? The, 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 well, I believe. You can easily it's right pass there. the fence. It's just... Yeah, let's try not to kill any there. Really healthy, actually. Yeah, this is looking pretty good. Well, because we'd like to know how it landed, because we had goals about how it was going to land. Well, it looks like it's in good shape. It looks like it's in good It looks like it landed pretty good. I don't see any arms broken. Nope. Fins still attached. So. Yeah, but that is it did it did flop upside down. Let's turn that one off. Is it still on? Camera's off. It's about 400 degrees. Alright. Can I open it? Shuttle, I Metro it? Shuttle's lost its Ready? Ready? Oh, chapstick! I used, I used, no! Uh, lip balm, sorry. Lip balm. Lip balm.